Hey, once again, it's your boy, Daddy, for Triple B Gaming, coming at you with another FS22. You know how we do it. Let's get to it. All right, ladies and gents. Uh, so, in this one, um, like we always do, just pick it up from the last episode. Uh, we just got our cow barn sh uh, shed, stable, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> We just got that put in, so, uh, and got our cows in there. So now we have to, uh, make up some more total mixed ration, get them fed. Um, maybe blow some straw in there, even though I don't have a manure pit in at this moment. Um, then we can go sell some pallets. Uh, we got a lot to do. Um, I want to take and Cut these trees down right here, and then cut this hillside back. Cut this hillside back like this. And then over here like this, and then maybe trim it down a little bit more down through like that. Um, that way we can push, get rid of the shed, push all that back, and add some garages. Something that we can actually close so it isn't dropping our frame rate. But that's the game plan, so let's get to it. So I think, I think, <laughs> I'm pretty sure that this will blow straw into the barn for us. It's called it Husbrian. I can't even pronounce it, so I'm not even going to try. So we're just going to keep calling it a barn. <laughs> What did I do with my weight? The snow's it hit a nice sunny day. The snow is melting. Graphics card just updated, the uh, uh, Windows 10 just updated. I think it might be, I don't know, something ain't, something ain't right. My frame rate's down, like, like big time. Look, this, this snow just melted like that, like, they should <laughs> They should have it to where it doesn't melt, like, instantly. Instant melt snow. Man, I should have put this down a little different I don't know how much uh, straw you gotta put in there like our, our front loaders done a lot of work <laughs> but uh, I want to upgrade to a high lift. We need a high lift. Oh, 
at least for here on the farm anyway. Man, we could sell some of our silage. I was wanting to do like um, the closed in bunkers and take the bunker out right there and put like two or three um, closed, closed in bunkers in there and then have one for silage, one for our straw and then one for hay. Uh, but the ones that are in game, they're just way too big to fit them in there. I could get one in there. There's one. It's it's massive. And then the other two that we have are, um, well, the other one that we have is like the ones down at the BGA, and that's it. Which those are too big as well. It'd be. Uh, fine if I just had one but that's defeating the purpose I wanted a couple of them now I do have a silo that holds silage hay and straw but I was wanting to put it in a bunker not a not a silo I mean, these cows are a lot of work. <laughs> I knew it was. I knew it was going to be some work, but man, they need uh, round the clock attention. I need to get a little um, skid steer or something too, so we can keep. Just go ahead and keep it down at the sawmill. That way, when we're loading our pallets out at the sawmill, we don't have to uh, worry about taking this down there, or having to wait for it. Because if you don't have a weight on it, it just tips forwards. Um, we still have a lot of wood in there. Um, all the trees we cut down. Uh, the last trees we cut down, we sold them. So, I want to get some more wood in there. Just so that's just like an ATM that never stops. You know what I'm saying? There's there's still like a hundred liters in it, but I want to get I want to get some more in it. I just need to make some money real quick so we can buy some construction equipment. Um, I might go ahead. Like I said, I want to get this out of here. Them trees. That way we can push this hillside back right here. Um, whenever we do that, that will give us some money to buy whatever we need uh, just until then <laughs> All right, let's see if this works sides it on of course it's on the other side Man, my steering, my steering wheel is just like too easy sometimes. We still got that tree down there and it's sold. I know there's something messed up with these uh, sh uh, barns to where it really doesn't blow, blow right. Let's see if we can get it to work here. Oh, look at that. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. For some reason, you gotta be right there on a the corner. Huh. Blows back in there.
I don't know how much it actually takes. We definitely don't have enough. No. That feed, that's driving me nuts right there. I'm talking a lot because my headphones are too loud. Um, turn them up a little bit. Um, oop. That's driving me nuts. Like there should be a trough or something here. I think it's supposed to be down in the ground here maybe I don't know but that's just weird how it's if like it's probably supposed to be like that but it should be wider there's their water now they have straw yeah you can you can definitely tell that it ain't enough because there's a hole there and there I, I guess this is for giving birth <laughs> Yeah, they give birth there, drink there, get milk, get milk there. Um, yeah, I don't know. <laughs> oh man, there he's being lazy. What you doing, bro? Get up, bro. That's awesome. Ah. Oops, hitting the wall. Let's see what we got in there. Uh, straw. Oh, yeah. We didn't even fill it up halfway. So, productivity zero, milk zero, slurry zero, straw. So, we need to get our total mix ration done now. Uh, yeah, I messed up by putting it in there like that. I messed up. I'll tell you what, guys. Uh, I'm going to run to the store and grab a bale of straw. And uh, I'll be right back. Alright. So now we got our straw. Obviously, it's too much, so we gotta pull in here. Yeah, this is why we need some bunkers or some silos or something. Something to hold this stuff. I guess I could have just went and dumped some of it out in the uh, barn, but it'll be alright. Alright, so now. See what we got here. Turn the help menu on. It kind of sucks. You gotta turn the help menu on for this. Uh, all right, we probably need more in there, but. I'd rather have to add to it than to have to take out of it. Uh, how'd I get... <laughs> I don't know how I just got hay in the bucket, but we did. I think we might have too much straw in there. Ain't nothing I can do now because I done mixed it. <laughs> yeah, picking up hay and and straw, it's not very heavy, so it shouldn't tip your tractor boards, but it does. Oh yeah. We got, yeah, see the straw, you barely need any of it. 
Of course, we got way too much in there. Only other hay I have is in bales. I don't think there's a, a shredder in game, is there? Like just a, a regular bale shredder? I mean, obviously you can use this thing. Um, put it in there, let it shred it, and then dump it back out. But as far as just a shredder, I don't think there's a base game shredder. Oh, you know what? Whenever they did that update, I think they added a shredder. Alright, anyhow. Let's see. Ooh. Man, we are sick. <laughs> Still, still too much. Um, I mean, as long as we get some more um, hay in there, I think we'll be all right. Hopefully that didn't just make it all, uh, did that just make it all hay? Ha! <laughs> We're about to find out. It looked like it. That's definitely not what I was trying to do. Trying to dump it out so I could put a bale of hay in it so it would shred it for me. Yeah, well, I guess that works too because it just turned all that straw into hay. Works for me, I guess. in there, put all this in there, and we'll start putting our silage in it. I gotta get rid of that strip of grass there. I was trying to make it look look better, but it didn't work out. Yeah, according to plan. <laughs> I'll get this little piece right here.
think we need a lot more of this, but we better test it. <laughs> Just to be sure. Alright. I guess that worked out for the better. Turning that straw into hay for us. Oh, wow. Probably should have just time lapsed this. Cause now we ain't gonna get much house done because it takes so long to do this. There's gotta be a better way. I mean I know just dumping uh if you have the right size bales, just dropping bales in it. Um Well, there is a better way when you have the the self mixer and not just a wagon here. Did it just turn? Uh, I was like, did that just turn that to silage? But it turned it to a total mix for us. So we. Like, we couldn't get any closer with that. Uh, hey, though. <laughs> now we gotta put our mineral stuff in here. You know what? In real life, they use this. But they also use like a bag of garlic, garlic, uh, powder, some, something like that. Man, our bags are going down, but our line ain't going up. Bags as it need. Oh, there we go. Now it's finally moving. We're going to have to get another pallet. Alright, that'll do. That'll do. Can feed these guys. Uh, so there is a factory, obviously. Um, it's actually a mod. I just downloaded and it's for uh for making silent or total mix ration so I might go ahead and get that eventually because it'll make it so much easier you just go get a full trailer and bring it back and dump it after you make it all you know what I'm saying so that might be a nice route to go down production uh, right here? Yeah, total mix ration factory. So, uh, you just bring all, everything in there, you dump everything, your straw, your hay, you dump it all right in there and it makes a total mix for you. <clears throat> um, I'm thinking you can either just sell it or, um, collect it. So, I'm not a hundred percent sure how that works. But there ain't no point in even getting it if you can't collect it. So we'll have to look into that. I might have to turn that hub back on. Man, I don't like running with the hub on. <laughs> Especially for uh, recording. See, the food, it doesn't really matter too much. For the straw, it does. I'm <laughs> blowing it right on his head. We're going to have to bring more straw in, too. Uh, so, like, I know we can't get manure without the straw, but do, uh, do they actually need it in the new game? I know they didn't need it unless you wanted manure. But in this one, I think it actually affects the production and everything. If you don't, I'm not sure. I ain't gonna lie to you because I really don't know. Uh, let's see. Man, we still don't have that food all the way up. It says 100%, but 
We're at three percent there. So we got some milk. We actually have some slurry now. I don't know if that's because we added straw or what. Um, good there. I had these guys up to a hundred. Well, it was seventy-five, but they were a hundred. But when I whenever I pulled them out of uh their pasture, so I could build the new. Oh wow! So I could build the new uh, barn. They dropped down, so. Puberty, sixty-six <laughs> percent. Brown Swiss. So does it? Do they hit puberty, and then after that hits a hundred percent, then it goes up to uh, production? We'll have to keep an eye on that. See how that works. All right. All right. guess since we're already at it here we might as well go ahead and blow the rest of this straw into there so we don't have to do it later well as quick anyhow I wanted, I wanted to get a lot more done this episode, but it it's impossible without time lapsing or having a ridiculously long video. So we'll go ahead and just finish take, taking care of our cows here and then we'll move on. Next episode we will... Um, We have, we do have to go get rid of the uh, plank pallets down at the sawmill because our pallets are almost full down there, and I think after this gets all the way full, it'll just stop making them. As you see, we have uh, we started off with a hundred, like a hundred and four, uh, hundred and four thousand liters. We're down to eighty nine. 89,000 right now uh, but I think after this gets full it'll stop until you get rid of them uh, so we got a lot of wood in here for a lot of pallets uh, every thousand every 500 gives you one pallet every 500 liters 500 600 something like that um, so if you have a hundred thousand uh, liters I think you get 50 pallets out of it so I do want to get more wood in there so that's just continuously going and then after I get so much wood into it we built the other building for selling wood so after we get that the sawmill uh, so full for for our pallets and then we'll just start uh, getting rid of our wood if we have more wood we'll just sell it for cash Um, so I want, I wanted to do the carpenter, yeah, the carpenter's, uh, production too, for making furniture. And that takes, uh, planks. So we'll take our planks from the sawmill and we can take them over to the carpent, uh, carpenter's factory. But it doesn't just take plate. Uh, planks. You gotta put planks and trees in there. I thought it was just planks you had to put in it. You could put planks and or trees in it, but you actually have to put both. So maybe later on here we'll start making furniture. Just because we can. <laughs> uh, and it pays very well. 
a lot better than the tree itself and or the planks. Uh, our overall goal is to have as much money in the bank account without cheating as possible. And then uh, as far as Brock or the, the stone goes, we're going to build the factory like this map or this series man my mouth's dry this series uh, excuse me too many energy drinks <laughs> all that salt man uh this series we are doing everything like animals logging farming uh productions and uh tp so we're going to be doing construction and everything like we got everything happening so like i said this is the tp map i haven't showed you guys nothing on it yet um and then we have the terraform mod as well so whenever we cut that hillside back over there instead of using um the landscaping tool we'll just use the terraform and we'll just like actually cut it back so that's the game plan like i said we got we got a lot going on here guys a lot Should have built them holes in. I like how the cows actually roam around in here. I don't think they did that in 19, did they? I don't know. I'm asking you like you're actually there talking to me. <laughs> but, uh, like I said, I never did anything with animals in 19. But I don't think they actually roamed around in here like that. Alright, so. As far as our cows now, we have... Uh, straw still ain't full yet, <laughs> but I'd hate to see what the big the big barn takes. Um, at least we don't have to put water in here though. That's that's like a plus. It's less you have to do. So if you're looking, like if you're wanting to have a lot to do, that takes it takes from you. <laughs> as far as that goes. I gotta fix that ground right there. So I'm gonna make more total mix ration, but I'll probably do it off camera. Like normally when I'm doing series like this, I don't do anything. Everything I do is all on camera, but that's pretty tedious and we just did it. So I don't wanna do it to you again. I'm probably gonna make another round of total mix and get that completely filled up. Why is that ground humped up right there? We're gonna fix that real quick. Landscape. It was like that all the way around here too, but I fixed it. <laughs> Gets rid of our tire marks too. And this here, I just don't like how it doesn't let you zoom in any further than that, so you can't really see what's happening. Oh yeah, that was really humped up. And it's not like there was uh, a building or nothing there. So I don't know why it was so messed up right there.
happening right here. I'm going to try to fix this here too. I did this. Ooh. I did this to the other one as well. I raised the ground up around it. Just when you run it over, it doesn't throw you clean up in the air. It's not wanting to raise it. Let me move that tractor. It's probably in the road, too. So. Trailer's probably in the road as well. It is really not picking the ground up right there. Yeah, you see how See how I got that side? It's like real flush. I just couldn't get the other side because it wouldn't pick the ground up. Might be because that trailer's in the road. Still ain't bad though. It's pretty good actually. Um, there we go. That's not tossing us up in the air anymore either. I'm going to go ahead and see if I can get that other drain fixed too while I'm at it. So you just raise the ground up around it and then go to your smooth tool. Just barely tap it until it Wait. Oh yeah. Look at that smooth. Oh, there's still another one over there. I don't like the moving around here. Like, I wish it would let you zoom in further. Like, you can't see what you're doing. Like, that's as far as it'll let me zoom in. Like, that's my biggest pet peeve about, uh, the new landscaping tool. Other than that, I like it. It's pretty decent. But, again, and, and, um, like, zooming out, like, right here, like, it won't let you look down anymore unless you zoom in. That's another, another thing I don't like about it. 
So if it if it wasn't for that, uh, it would be okay. turned <laughs> man doing that just made the video longer than I wanted it to be oh yeah that's way better we'll hunt back here all right guys so Ooh. stuck I didn't even fix this one, did I? No, I sure didn't. Um, but anyhow, that's it for this one. So, uh, like I said, in the next one, we're going to go sell some pallets, and then we'll start working on that hillside there so we can get some garages in here. Um, and that's going to give us some money, too. Get rid of them trees, sell them trees, and then uh, selling the material coming out of that hillside there. Um but that's the game plan. So if you like what you see, go ahead and hit that like button. If you want to see what's coming, what's next, hit that subscribe button, mash them notification bells, and I'm out. Doses.